Well, hello everybody. Uh, I want to show you um, the problems that I have had with this specific Bible. I'll tell you a short story. Uh, I, I purchased this Bible from originally from Alan, uh, Alan's website, uh, in Goatskin. Uh, but as you can see in these pictures, I'm going to show you now. The Bible had several problems with the text block. The actual margins were all over the place. And this uh, drives me mad. Uh, I don't know if uh, this would be okay for you, but definitely it's not okay for me. So um, I contacted them and they said to me, and we understand the situation, please send it back to us. We will refund you fully. But they did not refund me my... Uh, the fee they had to pay basically for the, the, the delivery, the postage. And, uh, so to make the story short, I ended up with 20 euros short and very, very uh, upset. So I decided to try to buy the same Bible from Crossway. And uh, this is the box. Uh, this is uh, the classic reference Bible, same text, text block, sorry. Uh, but this one is in calfskin black color. As you can see here, it's a uh, crossways uh, typical box, which I think is very nice. And uh, anyways, what's the problem with this one? Well, the problem with this one is not the text. The text is perfect. Well, well the print is excellent. The margins are perfect everywhere you go. You don't have that problem that I had with the Allen, you see? every single page has the same margin so why they can do this and Alan cannot I don't understand although I was given an explanation in my view that's something that that cannot happen uh, in a Bible uh, of this uh, uh, we consider premium Bibles but what's the problem with this one the problem with this one is this see that you have a normal yap, which is okay, but as soon as you turn, the yap is nearly gone. Yap, no yap. Yap, no yap. We're going around. Same thing again. Yap, nearly non-existent yap. So what happens with this Bible is when, whenever you open the Bible, okay, say so you are opening the Bible, and now you close it, those pages, as you can see here, are already cut. There you go. They, 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 they tend to, to be um, cut in between the liner and the cover. And that is going to damage the pages in no time. But that's not the worst part. When, when I mentioned this to the uh, bookstore where I got it from, they said, no problem, uh, keep this one. And we're going to replace it with a new one. Uh, we are so sorry for that. So I was okay with it. I said, okay, thank you. Uh, I'll keep this one. The most important part is the tax. But obviously you're paying uh, uh, around 80 euros, 85 euros. I think I pay for this one. You expect this Bible to be in, in a good condition. So I go here, my replacement. And guess what? It is even worse. Not only I had that problem, but also look at this. See the stamping. That O oh, there from version was it looks like smear. Like it has that that the, the O is, is filled in with gold. Uh, it shouldn't be anywhere. And uh, the yab here is okay, but here we go. You turn over and. It's like crooked. Look at this. There's no yap here. I mean, there's not even a quarter of an inch of yap here. I don't think. Here's where you can actually see it. See what I'm saying? There's that's a good yap there, but there's no yap here whatsoever. What's wrong with this binding? I don't know. And uh, also here, it's so stiff. The glue is all over the place. Look at the glue coming through. Over oh, this place, uh, that's I don't know. To me, that's very, very poor uh, 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 put together. And look at that. 
don't tell me that is a scar of the animal. That looks like a cut from a knife. Like it went through this and got stuck there and basically you can actually put your finger under that piece of leather. And uh, anyway, I think uh, for some reason I... I was not I was not meant to to have this Bible the ESV one or the, the classic references uh, classic reference Bible from from uh, uh, Crossway so I called the book depository.com where I got these Bibles from and they said to me we are so sorry that could be a bad batch uh, we're gonna refund you so they're gonna give me my money back for these two Bibles that, as you can see, are in a very poor condition. And also, uh, they asked me uh, to keep them. They didn't want them back. They are so sorry. And uh, well, that, what else can I say? I would have wished to have no one or two or three, but just one in a good condition. Uh, I would have been happy with just one of them to be okay. I didn't need to have two in, in a poor condition. Uh, so just for you guys to 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 uh, bear this in mind, if you're going to purchase one of these, uh, Alan, I show you in the pictures what the problem was in this from Crossway. The problem is a totally different issue. Uh, by the way, this is, uh, I'm gonna show you. Uh, this one is printed in China, so this is a, pr a China uh, a printing, and it looks here's the date that this was done, right there. So it is a 2016 edition, but what can I say? I'm not pleased with this at all. Uh, Damaged the binding, uh, crooked, very bad put together, doesn't... Look at this. Maybe I'm too picky, but... I would have expected this margin, sorry, this yap to be as wide as this one. But, uh, oh, sorry, and I forgot about this one. The actual spine is separating from... There you go, look at this. How is that possible for a brand new Bible from Crossway? Anyway, leave it at that. Uh, I'm so sorry uh, uh, for bringing this bad news, but uh, sometimes things like this happen. And uh, if you are looking for one of these Bibles, bear this in mind, you may be coming across uh, something uh, like this. Please don't forget to like our videos and share with others. Unsubscribe if you haven't done so. Thank you very much. See you soon. Shalom.